Most of the countries at the top of a new list of the world's richest are not the biggest or most powerful. In fact, a lot of them are small, take Luxembourg, which is at the top of the list that Global Finance put out. The only Grand Duchy in the world is followed by Singapore, Ireland, Qatar, Macau, and Switzerland. Today's video is about the richest country in the world, Luxembourg. Before we start discussing in detail, please subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon as well. The things that show a country's wealth can vary from one ranking to the next, which is why they aren't all the same. However, the gross domestic product, the GDP per capita, the average amount of money that each person in a country earns in a year, and the gross national income GNI, are often used. Examining the per capita GDP of every country in the world is a common metric because it lets countries be ranked by their wealth and then compared to each other. Are there fair indicators? The World Population Review says, remember, though, that GDP per capita does not always equal the average wage of a person living in a given country. For example, the United States GDP per person in 2019 was $65,279.50, but its average annual wage was $51,916.27 and its median wage was $34,248.45. In their analysis of the world's richest countries ranked by GDP, the organization says, even the richest countries have some people living in poverty, and even the poorest countries have some very wealthy people living there. But GDP is a good measure of a country's overall financial health. Global Finance says that when a ranking is mostly based on GDP, the richest countries tend to be among the biggest. Tax Havens and Other Peculiarities how can the economies of such small countries as Luxembourg be as strong as those of the countries on the list? The World Population Review says that international business practices can sometimes make GDP values wrong. Some countries, like Ireland and Switzerland, are known as tax havens because their governments have tax rules that help businesses from other countries. For these countries, a big chunk of what shows up as GDP may actually be money that international companies send through that country instead of money that stays there. Sophisticated Finances, Taxes, Natural Resources A lot of the wealth in small countries like Luxembourg, Switzerland, and Singapore comes from their sophisticated financial sectors and tax systems that are set up to attract foreign investment and skilled workers. Other countries in the top 10, like Qatar, Brunei, and the United Arab Emirates, have a lot of hydrocarbons and other valuable natural resources. Macau is known as the gambling capital of Asia, and its casinos bring in a lot of wealthy tourists. The pandemic effect. In any case, all indices had to be changed for 2022 because of the effects of the global COVID-19 pandemic, which caused many businesses to close or cut back on their activities and made it possible for more people to work from home. Global Finance says that in 2014, the country's GDP per person went over $100,000. Luxembourg spends a lot of its money on improving housing, healthcare, and education for its people, who have the highest standard of living in the Eurozone by far. Luxembourg is a small country in Western Europe that can only be reached by land. It is surrounded by Belgium, France, and Germany. Luxembourg is the only Grand Duchy in the world. It is home to 642,371 people. It has the highest GDP per person in the world at $140,694. The average length of life is 82 years, and the unemployment rate is just over 5%. Everyone in the country gets free health care, education, and public transportation. The government of Luxembourg is stable and works well, and the country has a high standard of living and a stable economy. In Luxembourg, big companies like Skype and Amazon have their headquarters. So that's it for today. If you find this video interesting, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new uploads. In the end, thanks for watching and see you next time.